All right, you click Lieutenant Jim Gordon. Uh, my personal favorite out of this uh, two pack here, because for starters, it's a new figure, and I like that. And they used a new sculpt, sort of. The only thing that's basically a new sculpt, I would say, is the jacket and the head and glasses. I bought the two-pack because I didn't have that prototype suit Batman or this figure. And I really wanted this figure. Uh, I really like this figure a lot. Um, mostly because it's mostly a new sculpt. Uh, he has new uh, arms right here. These are new sculpted arms. It's not reused, but uh, I think the torso and legs may be reused from the Harvey Dent figure slash Two-Face figures. Also, it has a Great resemblance to Gary Oldman. I like the uh, glasses they put on him. It looks very nice. Uh, it's really nice detailing on this figure because the trench coat looks amazing. I like the way it falls and how it looks like maybe the wind is blowing or something. How because his collar's not quite perfect. It's kind of uh, blown to the side. And these little buttons are a nice touch. His sleeves. So for accessories, this figure came with a gun. Well, it uh, fits nicely in his hand, just like that zips in and out, and um, you can, you know, have him posed, you know, like ready to shoot someone, or, you know, maybe a kill shot, that's how you know it's a kill shot, because it's tilted, uh, that's pretty much it for accessories, get that out of his hand, and for articulation, he basically has the same as the DC Universe Classic and other Movie Masters, uh, head can rotate 360 degrees around, but it's kind of handed by the jacket right here, goes up and down, rotates 360 at the shoulder, Oh, as well as go in and out at the shoulder. 360 at the bicep, bends at the elbow, rotates 360 at the wrist. Uh, he does have an ab crunch. Uh, legs go forward, back, in and out, rotates at the upper thigh, bends at the knee, and at the ankle. But not very much. So overall thoughts on this figure is, uh, if you're a movie master collector, then I definitely recommend this figure. It is a must for your collection. Especially, you know, because like he's a new figure and uh, basically, you know, I, I'm i not going to lie, I'm going to buy any Movie Master figure that has a new sculpt. You know, I like new sculpt, that's like my favorite thing. So I would say this is a definite must for any Movie Masters collector. Uh, thank you for watching, catch you next time.